I know it's really early, but what have you seen? Yeah, from the uh, from the early morning workouts and uh, the first day, first two days of spring ball, look promising. Uh, athletic, fast, big, uh, small. You know, running back details, running a better pad level, things he's going to figure out once we start uh, tackling and things like that. But picking up the offense well, and he's working at it really hard. What did he show when he was running scout team that made y'all think this would be a good move? Uh, just that, just that side speed ratio. And the guy that had a knack for just some natural running ability, setting up blocks, uh, making people miss, catching the football, um, and having a big enough body to be able to help us in pad protection as well. So what were those conversations like when y'all were talking about possibly moving to running back? Yeah, um, it started, you know, it started it's funny. All the defensive coaches came to me one day uh, during the fall and uh, just bragging about how well he was, he was portraying one of the running backs for whatever team we were playing. And, then all of a sudden, they caught fire with some of the with some of the, the kids, and and he just wanted an opportunity to be able to help this team, you know, and be able to contribute more. He's done a great job on special teams already, and if it's an opportunity for him to help as a running back by moving up the ladder and being in a more natural position, let's give him a shot and see what he can do. What, what's the rotation like right now with the running backs? Uh, there's really not one. I think every one of them are all trying to fight for the starting job. Uh, Sweeney probably has the most experience right now, but he was the uh, third string for us last year. Um, so just trying to see where he's at, see can he take another step from, you know, being injured to finally playing a full season to going through a spring and see how much he can improve. And Scotty Phillips is brand new, Isaiah is brand new, Armani's brand new. Uh, you know, just it's kind of like a ball of marbles right now. Just trying to see who's what right now. Do you expect to have Penniman for August? I do, I do. Um, I think uh, his uh, his progression is going well right now. Uh, he's getting to where he can move around and do some rehab things. But uh, with Pat, and uh, fully expect him to, to be available for us this this August. Is this one of the more inexperienced groups you've had in your career? It's kind of fun. I, 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 yeah, I guess you could say that. And it's fun. You getting a chance to to teach brand new guys again. I keep uh, yelling out uh, doing stretch. Uh, the last few days, they got brand new blood. There's new blood, just teaching everything from scratch and uh, just seeing a look in their eyes because they don't know really anything yet. And, and uh, so it's, it's been fun to have some new guys. Is your approach different since they're uh, new faces? Uh, same approach. I think uh, I think more time is being spent, more emphasis on things. Um, you know, not taking anything for granted, that assuming they know anything, just starting from ABCs and Kind of, again, the same way we put this offense in last year with Coach Longo. Derek, you got Jordan Wilkins going through the NFL Combine right now. Just Can you talk a little bit about he, how he kind of came into his own last year as, as a senior? Uh, just, uh, I mean, just kind of a four-year, five-year progress for him, you know, progression for him. Um, being the high school kid that he was and developing each year, he was always a talented guy. And, uh, you know, we never wanted to have him sit out, but he sat out that year, and I think it helped him mentally and physically, uh, the mental part, just being able to come back and watch film and analyze his game, watching other backs. And he was actually the scout team running back for our defense that year. And I just think it helped him tremendously in setting up blocks, knowing what was going on besides his job, and helped him perform better to go along with that talent that he had. What's the fit for him in the NFL? Is there, is there an offensive system that, that you think if he were to get in with a team like that, that he'd have a better shot? Really, in my opinion, I think Jordan is, a, is an every down back. I think he can fit with anybody. I think he's uh, big enough to run between the tackles. He has enough speed to give you the long ball. He can catch out of the backfield. He's a willing pass protector. And uh, he's shown the ability to make guys miss. I mean, the probably only thing is, you know, for Jordan, just showing consistency and doing it again.